The heart's really important in terms of health issues. It's really the number one cause of death worldwide. Something like 17 million people die every year from heart disease. It kills more people than AIDS and all cancers combined. So if we can do something to tackle some of the problems of heart disease, that will make a really big impact. The stethoscope is a really important frontline tool. It's something that every clinician will have. If you look on a television program, the, the stethoscope is the thing that's around their neck all the time. So whenever somebody will be admitted to a hospital, almost the first thing that somebody will do is to listen to your heart, listen to your chest. And if there's some extra information that can be gathered from that, maybe automatically, that would be a way of getting that extra diagnosis information without having to put any additional burden onto the frontline doctors. The idea that we had as part of this uh, project was to see if we can help them to have a device that would separate the heart sounds out automatically and allow them to listen to each valve separately one at a time. That would be really fantastic if we were able to achieve that. For me, this has been a really interesting research project. I started in musical sound source separation. So we were interested in the problem of how you could record something in stereo, for example, but might have those instruments mixed together in different ways when they're recorded. Having access to these sort of digiscopes in the longer term as they're rolled out could help with early diagnosis of heart conditions, particularly where it's not suspected at the beginning, but they've come to hospital for some other reason or just for a general checkup. The Digiscope research project started by us being contacted by a group in Portugal, Miguel Coimbra, and he was undertaking a project to build a device to analyse heart sounds and help doctors in the early stages of, of diagnosis. This was the first time that we'd worked on a project with a medical application and actually it wasn't something that we were looking for, it just wasn't on the horizon for us as a digital music group. So it was actually quite fascinating to be approached and have to think about, oh, that's interesting, that, that here we've got an application for a technique that we've been developing for music and some speech applications that has a potential medical application as well. One of the conditions that can be picked up are uh, heart murmurs where the valve doesn't completely close properly. So you can hear a sound in between where the normal beats should be. This research is really good for us to have a different view about what's important about where our research can make a difference. If you're applying something to a medical problem where you can really save lives, that's something that really does give you a good feeling to know that we're part of this project and to know that it will be leading in that direction is really something that helps us to think, yeah, this is important stuff that we're doing and we ought to keep doing it.